Now arriving, the woman charged with the task of managing, fixing, and updating a transit system derided by the governor-elect as a national disgrace. We are in crisis mode. Our roads and bridges are in desperate need of repair and rejuvenation, ranked among the worst in the country. We need a strong leader to oversee the department's multi-billion dollar capital program to ensure we are building strong new connections between our communities, not just putting down more Band-Aids. Murphy is nominating Diane Gutierrez Cassetti as the commissioner of the Department of Transportation. If confirmed by the state Senate, the New Jersey native will oversee the state's roads, rails, and airports. In 2016, the American Society of Civil Engineers gave the state's infrastructure a D plus, and it is New Jersey transit that may be the biggest challenge ahead. It is not going to be easy. It is not going to be simple, but I promise you 100% of my time and dedication to that task and to supporting the governor's promises that he made during his campaign to give a better commute to those people who live, work, and choose to live, work, and play in New Jersey. Our transportation infrastructure stands as the arteries and veins through which our state's economic lifeblood flows. Gutierrez Gassetti brings a lifetime of transportation experience. She is coming back to New Jersey from Florida, where she currently heads the Florida Turnpike Enterprise. And she spent two decades at the New Jersey Turnpike Authority, where she rose to be executive director. She was asked today about accusations that the agency is riddled with unqualified people. If there are jobs where people aren't performing, then we need to deal with that. We need to make certain that we have people in the right seats on the bus. But is there enough money to pay for that bus? Governor Christie has proposed fare increases to pay for repairs and a new Hudson River tunnel. It seems like they go up no matter what anyway. So and sometimes when they raise it and say this is for this, they don't technically put it to that. I mean, it's not reliable. So, you know, that, that reliability factor, if that went up, that might be worth paying a little more. This is the governor-elect's sixth cabinet pick. Five have been women. Murphy made criticizing the transportation system a key part of his campaign. Now he's in the driver's seat, and he and his future commissioner will have to manage a system that is short on cash and long on priorities. In Secaucus, Andrew Schmertz, NJTV News.